Hello, today guys I'm going to teach you how to set up dual monitor displays for your computer. The first thing you want to, uh, you're going to want to do is uh, go down behind your computer and look for the graphics card which is there. Now uh, that's just a VGA, uh, VGA and that's a DVI um, so you want to go yeah, you're going to want to make sure that uh, you have two slots, uh, slots, sorry I can't talk, I have the cold, but you wanna go, you're want to going to want to make sure that you have the two slots on your graphics card, otherwise you won't be able to do this. Um, since I have a gaming computer, it came pre-built with the dual monitor capabilities. Uh, I'm going to upgrade that so it can hold uh, hold free monitors. So uh, we'll put this back and uh, we'll go up and set it up. Um, push that over there. There. Uh, okay, so uh, on standard, uh, you're going to want to go to uh, screen resolution. Um, what will happen, um, what it will show up, first of all, is, uh, it'll be like a, uh, projector effect, um, but what you're going to want to do is, uh, if you go into your, uh, settings here, you're going to want to go to, Extend these displays and uh, apply and keep. And then you'll notice whenever some might. Um, I can move the mouse over and uh, and uh, yeah, it um, it's on your own monitor display. You can move windows across. So if I go like that, I can move windows across, and uh, it gives you a lot of. It gives you a lot more work room if you have the extra monitor and the cables. Uh, the cable I'm using for the TV, um, for the Samsung even, is a, VGI, a VGA to DVI uh, cable. Um, I picked it up on Amazon for pretty cheap. I'm sure you could as well. Uh, I'm just using the standard VGA cable for the, for the screen there. So, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, more videos will come up soon whenever I am feeling better. Um, you can probably tell in my voice that I'm, <coughs> that I'm sick. Um, so I'm going to head here before I lose my mind and uh, play about my dual monitor displays. Goodbye.